Longview residents expressed their concerns this evening as the city council approved for a biomining facility to take over a building in a residential area. Our Dan Belay was at that meeting and shares with us how the community is responding. I've got loop 281 behind me. I'm looking at the old Tri-W Global building. After tonight's Longview City Council meeting, though, this could soon become the newest bio mining process facility in the country. And that's a decision that a lot of the citizens from Longview that were at tonight's meeting are not happy with. I'm, I'm very disappointed and it appears as if this was a predetermined decision. I'm really full of outrage. A lot of frustration coming from the folks that attended tonight's city council meeting. There were numerous items on the agenda, but it was clear that most were there to voice their opinion on the proposed bio mining process facility. A few supported the project, many opposed, but in the end, city council unanimously decided to allow Mint Innovation to receive a special permit and locate their first bio refining facility in the U.S. I don't care how careful you are, there's always human error. There's always the possibility of equipment malfunction. There's no way they can guarantee 100% that there will be no negative effects from this company, the biomining company, uh, establishing themselves. Carolyn Northcutt, as well as the majority of those who spoke tonight, raised concerns about the effects the facility could have on the surrounding community. She mentioned there are multiple schools, churches, and neighborhoods within just a few miles of the site. Beyond questioning the location in town, other members of the community are wondering, why Longview at all? Why, why here? This is the first facility in the United States, first city in the United States that's going to be subjected to this technology. And uh, I don't know why. I, I don't have an answer for that. Now, just because City Council approved the permit for the facility doesn't necessarily mean it'll be coming to Longview. Instead, the city now enters a list of finalists among other cities in the country that are being considered for the project. In Longview, Dan Millay, CBS 19. If Longview is chosen for the facility, it would employ between 20 to 28 people for jobs that will pay about $60,000 annually. We reached out to Mint Innovation for comment and are waiting to hear back from them. We will continue to follow this developing story.